must say the spectacular event last night was so impressive. What CPC does something quite unique. Pakistanis not only see Chinese as iron brothers, but they also think that Pakistan's relationship is as high as the Himalayas. I played over 20 years of international sport. Uh, and since I became the Prime Minister, I hardly have any time to watch any international sport. So being invited uh, to watch the Winter Olympics was, first of all, you know, a great pleasure for me. It was just spectacular. I've never seen such an event like that and fireworks and then the, especially the, the, the effect of lighting. So much hard work must have gone into it. It was just out of the world. To hold Olympics in, in during the pandemic, it is one of the most difficult things to do. The only way, only country could do it, which has incredible discipline. If you do not have the sort of discipline you have in China, you could not have held this event. This is my fourth visit as a prime minister. China changes every two years. You can't recognize it. You come here and the cities change. You know, you think you're in some different country. In fact, I've never seen a country change so quickly in terms of infrastructure. In Pakistan, there is no tradition of winter sport. We are just beginning. Now we are looking at winter sports for the first time. And what I hope is that I'm going to get help from China in helping us develop our winter sports because we have the highest mountains out of you know the top 10 12 highest mountains half of them are in pakistan the main place where we could we could stage winter uh, sports are our northern areas but our northern areas basically were cut off from the rest of pakistan and it's ironic that it's china that helped us build what is called the Karakuram Highway. It's the road that linked the northern areas to Pakistan, helping us sort of in skiing slopes, cable cars, just maybe develop one or two resorts for skiing. People have no experiences yet of building skiing resorts. I think everyone will be watching this because this will be going live to Pakistan. And because, you know, we have a Pakistani competing in this Olympics uh, and of course you know with our close ties with China and of course me coming here and also promoting the Olympics in Pakistan so I think you know when people see the winter sports I think that's how the sports take off the greatest achievement of CPC the greatest achievement is what has is unique in the history of mankind. It's never happened in the history of mankind what the CPC has done. They have taken almost 700 million people out of poverty in the last 30 to 40 years. And I think this is where uh, certainly we in Pakistan want to learn from China. We are already learning. We are already trying to follow the Chinese model. How do we get our people out of poverty? For me, the most important challenge of a government is to take care of the people who are at the bottom of the social strata. And I again come back to the, the, the way it's dealt with COVID-19. If you look around the world, no other society has dealt with COVID-19 like, like China has. Uh, you look at Europe, uh, the United States, other countries, there are demonstrations against uh, against restrictions, against lockdowns. But in China, because the people believe in the government and they believe that the government looks after them, they impose discipline on themselves. I think it's a very impressive trait in China.